<laughs> Someone wanted to say hi before the video. Yeah. Alright guys, so I got my boiler here. I want to try to make it vertical so I can run my steam engine longer. I have no idea what that was. I want to try to make it run longer so I can, uh, you know, make it, see if I can make, make a better, uh, make a better boiler. But, um, I've already had it on here once on this brick thing. It didn't work very well because I had too much water. And as I've said before, if I had way too much water, it ended up being bad. What? What dog? So, I gotta lift this up here. Let me move my. I'm also gonna remount my 18.5 uh, horse. Dog, oh, you might wanna move. I'm having a really tough time getting this thing to burn because uh, the air is so damp out here that it's not wanting to burn very well. Yeah, I want to burn very well. I went and got some uh, old pallet boards. Something I can chip up. Where my knife with me? Let me go get my knife. I don't think I'd go anywhere without my Super Tinker Swiss Army knife. This thing is awesome. All sorts of weird blades. I got this dog bothering me again. Dog, I thought I told you to leave. I'm gonna have to spank you. That ain't much of a small wood. Is it on fire? I ain't wanting to burn. Got the dog investigating it. Okay, I got this funky adapter made up something like that. Got a one-way valve on it. I think that'd be neat. I think that may work actually better. Martha, leave my camera alone. I can hear the water in here boiling, or at least what water there is. Hopefully I got enough in there. I only got a 100 PSI pop-off valve. I got some I bought these, I bought this pipe wrench for two dollars, a Trimo, and I bought this one, this Trimo also, for uh, ten dollars. Couldn't pass that up. Already built up a little steam. I don't know if I was going to need that big one or not, but um, this is my first connector. Mm. Well, it looks like we're going to... Fortunately, I can't run the 18 and a half or 18.5 horsepower, so that kind of sucks. You can hear it. <laughs> Ow. Spoke. Anyway, guys. Alright, guys. First test. Check that out, guys. I'm at a vertical boiler. That's the one with no rings, keep in mind. I had to put the blower on it. 
Also got a one-way valve in it, so that may help. I got no oil in that thing because it always leaks water in it and it freezes. It's time this thing. It's how long it takes for it to completely stop. It's already been running it for, let's see, it, two minutes. Slow down. Minute and forty two. Well, Time it and see if it'll run any longer. this running and I'll go ahead and pause the camera. Slowing down a little bit. Oh, the wood be out. What the heck? It ain't that warm. Yeah, but it is going to still run. Five minutes. Six minutes. It kind of picked up in speed a little.
Alright guys. That's probably about the end of this video. So um yeah. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Mm -hmm. Oh and yeah, it ran for ten minutes.